Good morning, guys. Uh, today we are going to be headed out to go to Target. Um, and I found money in this purse. Oh, yeah. Miley found some money and she's going to. I found this. Three dollars, actually. I found this. And the babies. So. Miley, Mia, and Kai have a dollar each to spend at Target. I don't know how far that's going to go, but... I found this. We'll yeah, cool, man. Yeah. Uh, so, it is... Uh, we're starting the day pretty late. Um, it's almost... It's 11.30 now. And... We are going to be playing with fire. With fire, because if we leave... Yeah, if we leave to go to Target right now... Um, it's gonna cut into their nap time and um, they're just gonna be crazy, I think. So hopefully they are cool. Um, I don't know what's gonna happen. So we'll see how they react. Hello, we're at Target during nap time. <laughs> Not a good idea. Kids are having applesauce apple and I have little Keeny Koo that got a scratch on his face and that's all. We like Target because they have these kid seats. Any store that has these double kid seats, we pretty much only shop at. Because that's the only way we can do it. You guys ready to go in Target? Yeah. Yeah. So the key to a successful shopping trip at Target is popcorn. Target popcorn. These kids devour it. Huh? And then snacks. Because they get over popcorn and they want more snacks. Huh? You guys are hungry babies. Come here. No, we only have ices. <laughs> what are you looking for? This for my mom. Ooh, a turtle? Should, doesn't she need this? Totally needs that. How much is it? It's on sale for $17. Oh, cool. Clearance section. We love Target clearance items. I would not recommend going to Target with kids that didn't take a nap for one. No. No, never, never. Worse. It's crazy, crazy idea, bad idea. Um, and then on top of that, we were checking out and um, I'm sorry, but I was too busy hanging out with the kids and trying to keep them happy. And then we, I accidentally went to the express lane. Um, I didn't know. And we were starting to unload stuff. And then the people behind us, are, it's all PO'd. And now they're they're saying, oh, well, this is the express lane. We need, um, we only have two things. And we need to get out of here. Oh, okay. <laughs> the lady that said, as our babies are, everyone's like all crying to get out of the store with our stuff already on the conveyor belt. The cashier even said she didn't even know it was the express lane that she was checking out. And she was like, oh, it's not a big deal because it's not like we had like 50 items. The girl behind, the lady behind us was like, well, I only have two items and I need to be somewhere. Guess what she was buying? Tampons. So obviously she was grouchy. And she was so rude and we just let her go in front of us, but like she had to make it a big deal yeah. while our kids are crying. Oh, yeah. Like, hello, look at this. Yeah. And she knew we were having a hard time, yet it was more important for her to buy her tampons in front of us just so she can get out of the store. I'm sorry, like I normally don't play the card of I have five kids, but we were just doing the best that we could. I and I didn't need her, look at you hear this? Like I didn't need her attitude just to buy her freaking tampons 20 seconds faster. And then on top of that, we are almost done checking out. And then the people behind us even said, isn't this the express lane? To we didn't mean to. Come on. Golly, people, <laughs> like, loosen up. Like, it's not, is this extra two minutes in line really going to ruin your whole day, your whole life? It's worth being rude to people over? No, it's not. So just be nice, people. Chill, be nice. Goodness sake. I'm all worked up. 
gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we just got home and uh, Miley and Mia are out playing and riding bikes, but we have one baby boy that's sleeping still in the car. Look, he's like hugging his super soaker. He's <laughs> so tired. <laughs> the whole way home, we could just like hear him um, just snoring the whole time. <laughs> it was pretty funny. But these guys are outside and just enjoying the beautiful weather. We got the flag up. And uh, we're gonna have a good day tomorrow. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Okay, guys, we um, got a box in today. Right here. Okay, guys, we got a package in the mail today. And um, I'm gonna do a little bit of magic with Mia and Kai to uh, show you what we got. Okay. Yeah. Ah. Okay, put your hands out and say, Abaca. Boom! Say, okay, go like this. Both hands. Abracadabra. Abracadabra. Both of you on the same time. Abracadabra. Okay, Abracadabra. Say, okay, do this. Both hands. Okay, and then say abracadabra. Abracadabra! Boom! What? You didn't get that in the mail today. <laughs> Try it again. Try it again. Okay, say ab... But put your hands out. Without that. No, without it. Without the princess. Put the princess behind your back. Okay, and put your hands out. Just like Kai. Mia, just like I. Okay, and say abracadabra. Abracadabra! Oh, that's what we got today. A box from London. So, thank you, Stephen, for sending these, these boxes. Um, we're really excited to try it out, because I know Erica, um, I think she talked to you about trying Vegemite. I think that's how you say it. Um, so we'll put that in a, a different video that will be uploaded pretty soon, um, maybe in a few days. But um, yeah, we just want to say thank you, and we got the packages, so you should see that soon. Thank you again. Kale is like really into this little piece of napkin that's on the ground. He's just like so interested in it. It's funny because I'm like blowing it, and it's like... Moving and he's just like, oh. But here, here it is. Kale. 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 Okay, so tonight we had Chinese food, and I'm going to open my fortune. So, here it is. I already broke it, so I can do this with one hand. Oh, you will have a pleasant, you will have a pleasant trip. And what's this? Daily numbers, lotto six numbers. I will have a pleasant trip. Where am I going? I'll have a pleasant trip where? Uh, to the chiropractors. <laughs> yep, so that's mine. I'll have oh, a pleasant trip. Oh, we're going trip. tomorrow. Oh, tomorrow. we're going wine tasting tomorrow, so maybe that's what it means. 
So tomorrow we are going wine tasting for my cousin's um, going away like little party. She's moving to Chicago. So we are gonna be going to the Edna Valley area. If you know anything about wine or the or wine country, then you probably know Edna Valley. Um, we'll be going to quite a few wineries in San Luis, so you have to watch tomorrow's video so that you can see all the wineries we go to. Weston's driving us in our van, so stay tuned. I am? Oh, am I driving? I don't know. Or maybe I'm driving, we'll, we'll see. I can drive. No, it doesn't matter. We'll, we'll see. Stay tuned. Bye. Weston has this great idea for me to throw him a carton of fried rice across the, what is this, dining room and kitchen. I already know this is going to be a bad idea. It's going to be like a rice pinata. I'm not cleaning it. Just throw it. Right over here. I'm not cleaning it. This is proof. This is proof before I've thrown it that I'm telling you I'm not cleaning it. Okay. Oh my gosh, I'm so stressed out already. Come on. Weston. Oh my gosh, you guys. Go. Weston, I'm not kidding. This might be really bad. Hail Mary. Ready? Here, I have it. Oh my gosh. You can toss it or you can throw it, whatever. Right. You're gonna clean it if it makes a disaster? Yes. Okay. Ready? One, two, three. There we go. Oh! One piece of rice came out. One piece I'm of rice. I'm zooming in. I'm zooming in on you. I'm your cleaning head. it, Erica. I'm <laughs> gonna clean it up. I'm cleaning it up. Done. See, great idea. I knew it was a great idea. That's laziness at your finest right there. Bam. <laughs> laziness. I told you I'd walk it to you. You wanted me to throw it, freak. <laughs> It's crazy, huh, Kai? Say, so we don't throw food, Daddy. I didn't throw it, Mommy threw it. It's time, time for Big Brother. Brother. <laughs> I'm going to watch Big Brother. Um, like I keep saying, I'm one day behind. Um, who are you guys voting for? I still really like Clay. I hope that he gets away from that girl so that he doesn't get voted out. Um, Jace, I hope they can backdoor him. If you already know, don't tell me yet. Actually, I already have watched. Anyways, um, I hope they backdoor him because he's like already bugs me with like the hashtag bro code or whatever he keeps saying. I'm like, get over it. Like we he we heard you the first 76 times. Don't need to hear it again. Um, the twin. One of you guys told us who the twin was. I won't say in case you don't want to know. But I'm so excited about that twist because obviously, duh. What did? We have twins. One of the girls in the house, oops, I just said it. One of the people in the house is a twin, and there's gonna be like a twist. So um, I love that, obviously, because we have twins. Um, that and what else did we watch last night? Oh, Bachelorette. Yeah. Oh, I don't know how I like this season. 
too much drama. She's like creating it herself though. So. Yeah, she's not really nice to the boy. <laughs> um, because yeah, that's they, Miley's take on it. She doesn't always she watch doesn't. it, don't worry. So anyways, um, yeah, let's talk about Bachelorette. Anybody have a front runner there? If you know already because there's spoilers out online, don't tell me because it's like the one thing I can look forward to because we don't have cable, so it's like one of the shows I can actually watch. Anyway, so thanks for watching. Tomorrow, uh, we're going wine tasting. I've said that like 1,200 times in the like today's video. I'm going with my grandma. Yeah, Miley, me, and Kai are going to stay with um, Weston's mom. So, won't be that much video of you. Well, in the morning, and then when we come home, we're not going to be gone all day. So, anyways, um, look forward to watching that one tomorrow. And make we'll sure you subscribe oh. and like and share and see you next time guys. Bye guys. Bye bye. Okay, in your car seat. This what is the hurting it? cat's part. My cat. In your car seat. We just turned them around like two days ago, so it's their second time uh, facing forward. How do you guys like your car seats like this? Uh, it's great. It's great. <laughs> Good.